Great Saturday morning, everyone. Hi, I'm Christy. Welcome to our chair fitness class. So today um, I'm going to do a chair, straight up chair yoga class with some deep breath work. So all you're going to need is a chair, a sturdy chair, preferably with no arms. Um, yeah, and a little bit of an open mind because this is a different way to exercise. I think during the holidays we get kind of lost in the hustle bustle and get a little crazed a little bit. So this is a fantastic way to decompress, relax, and let go. All right, so let's give it a shot. I'm going to cue the music here. This um, playlist is compliments of Spotify. So if you have, if you enjoy different music apps like I do, Spotify and it's um, relaxing massage. Inhale. So let's think about giving our internal organs a massage with our beautiful breath. All right. Inhale. Exhale. Take a deep belly breath in, expand the belly, and exhale, contract. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. And again, breath in and breath out. Rest your palms right on your thighs. Take your feet a little wider than hip width distance apart. And so you have like a nice strong foundation. I want you to look to the right. Come center, look left. Come center, look right. At your range of motion, okay? And center left. One more time, each side. And left. All right, come center, take a deep breath in. We're gonna do a seated forward fold. Exhale, come forward. Inhale, roll up. Exhale, come forward. Inhale, roll up. And exhale, come forward. And roll all the way up. Bring your left hand behind you on the chair to support yourself. And then reach up with that right arm. Take a deep inhale. And as you exhale, lengthen through the right side of the body and let your gaze go upward. Just hang out there for a few seconds, just gently lengthening through the side of the body. Release down. And let's do that same thing on the other side. Notice any subtle differences or maybe not so subtle, from one side to the other. Inhale. Exhale, look up. Lifting up through the side of that body. Release down. Nice and slow. I love this class because it's not a fast paced class. Slower is better. Bring your knees even wider. We're going to bring this right shoulder towards the midline of the body. Just a gentle little press. It's going to wake up everything back here, all the way from the shoulder, all the way to the low back. Inhale. Let's do that left shoulder towards the midline of the body. Just a gentle stretch. And come up. Roll 
the shoulder blades down and back. Now I want you to tuck your chin to your chest. Let the weight of the head lengthen the back of the neck. Lift your toes up. Kind of wake up your toes. Wake up your feet. And lift up. All the way up, nice and slow. All right, now we're going to bring this right knee towards the right side of the room. All right, so you're sitting on the edge of your chair. So this right knee is pointing in that direction. And then I want you to take this left leg and kind of lengthen it. And if you can't, just keep it bent. That's okay. The idea is to lengthen right here through the left side of the body. So we're going to go up into a seated warrior one. And I want you to look up. Spin those pinky fingers in towards each other. Take a deep belly breath in, out. Again, breath in and breath out. Let your gaze go upward. open up into a warrior two so your gaze is down that right arm pull the shoulder so your shoulders are right over your hips your legs are the same so now we're going to heat up the core all right really generate some heat in the core muscles bring the right elbow down reach and lengthen overhead lifting through the left rib cage so I want you to think beautiful length here. Now engage the core, come up and let's go into reverse, drawing that navel to spine. We're gonna do that a couple more times. So give me some length right here in the right ribs. Inhale. Exhale. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. Again, breath in. Feel how just, just looking upward, you lengthen more in the left side of the body. Wow, that feels so good. I hope it feels as good to you as it does to me. And release. All right, now let's do just a little bit of spiraling before we go to the other side. So I want you to sweep up with the left arm, breath in. And I want you to bring your hand to the outer part of your right knee. Use, as a, use it as leverage and look over the shoulder as you exhale. Wringing out the spine, any toxins that's built up. And come center. Good, let's do that on the other side. Breath in. Bring the hand to the outer part of the left knee. Look over the left shoulder. Breath out. And come center. Now we're going to do that whole sequence um, that we did on the right side, on the left side. So knee comes towards the left side of the wall or the left wall and extend back your right leg. Now we're going to open up into our warrior one here, reaching, lengthening, opening through that right hip flexor, breath in, breath out. Are you breathing with me? Inhale, exhale. Inhale, 
and exhale into warrior two. So lengthening through that left arm, your gaze is down the left arm, your shoulders are right over your hips. There's a lot of intention here in the arms. Glide forward, bring the left elbow down, reach overhead and look up. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. And now float up. Breath in. Breath out. Breath in. Breath out. Inhale. Exhale. All right, so let's do a little bit more spiraling and then we're gonna get out of our chair and do some modified up dogs and down dogs. So what I want you to do, and if it's available to you, take your right leg, cross it over your left, or you can leave both feet on the floor, whichever you prefer. Sweep up with that left arm and then bring the hand to the outer part of that right knee and look over the right shoulder. So let's do like a, a little bit of a deeper spiraling set here. And release, come center. And if it's still available to you, I want you to bring the ankle right on top of the thigh. Again, you know, if you have hip replacement, knee replacement, you know what your limitations are, so please honor your body. If it hurts, don't do it. Inhale, exhale, pitch the body forward just a little bit. You're gonna feel a beautiful hip opener. Inhale. You know, anytime we're doing poses or postures, exhale, that hurt and you can't do it, just do the breath work. Just sit and do the breath work. Don't feel like you have to do anything. You don't have to do anything. This is your time. Inhale. And exhale. And release. All right, so now we're gonna cross the left over the right. Sweep that right arm up, breath in. Spiral, look over the left shoulder, breath out. You know, when you practice yoga, Tai Chi, these slower movements, it really is so good for balance in our life. And I certainly know it is hard to do these disciplines because it's slow and we're wired to go fast. Come center, but I promise you, if you take the time to slow down, it's worth it. Inhale. Exhale, pitch the body forward. Wow, this side is tighter. You don't have to go far, you really don't, to feel the stretch in your hip open. Breath in. Breath out. Again, inhale. 
exhale. And then come up. Bring both feet down. All right, so now we're gonna stand up. And uh, normally I do these um, stretches on the back of the chair, but today I'm gonna do them using the chair seat, all right? Because I just feel like it might be a little bit more friendly. So your back is, this is called table position, modified table position. And I want you to round through the back like a cat and arch, look up. Round like a cat, arch, look up. Now I want you to come to neutral spine here. And I want you to step back, take a couple steps back, and then press your upper body through your arms. So you feel that lovely stretch through the back through the torso, and you can kind of wiggle your hips just a little bit. Now press down into the chair, and here's your modified up dog, and look up. Come back to down dog. Keeping those heels to the floor. And then come back to up dog, pressing the hips forward, looking up. Back to down dog. And back to up dog. And come back. All right, walk your feet in. We're gonna do one balance pose, and then we're gonna go into final relaxation. So I'm gonna move the chair to the side. Just make sure the chair is there so you can hang on to it, you know, at any point, right? All right, so we're gonna balance on the right leg first. Sweep the left leg out to the side, and the right arm up. Now this is star, and I want you to try to let go of the chair if you can. Or if you can't, just hang on with a finger or two. So you're not gripping it, but you're practicing letting go. And maybe even hover, and then when you lose your balance, grab it. All right, so eventually you can open up into a beautiful star. Now using the core, I want you to pull that knee up and hold it. Extend the foot, bend, extend, bend, one more, bend and bring it down. All right, let's do that all on the other side. All right, so you're gonna balance on your left leg, sweep your right leg out to the side, left arm up, and again, staying here, Balancing, and then if you can, one finger, hover, reach. Oh, a little bobble there. Wobbles are wonderful, remember that. Now sweep the right knee up. Extend, bend. Extend, <laughs> bend, a lot of my chair is here. Extend, bend, and bring it down, good. All right, so let's revisit our chair, come back and have a seat. It's time for our favorite part, Savasana, final relaxation. So I just want you to really quiet your thoughts, quiet your mind, and I'm actually gonna turn this light out. I hope you can see me. I think you can. I'm gonna come a little closer to you. All right, so let's do some beautiful breath work together. <sighs> Sending each other massive amounts of love. All right, 
turn this way just a little bit. Okay. So close your eyes. Listen to the water and the music in the background. Keep your thoughts on the breath. Breath in. Breath out. Breath in. Breath out. Again, inhale and let go. Releasing, relaxing, letting go. Keeping our thoughts focused on the breath. Scan the body. Just notice. Feel the energy going through the body. Feel the heart beat. Notice the breath passing through the throat, deep into the belly. Every exhale, releasing and letting go just a little more. Feeling our hearts connected, knowing that we are connected. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, hands come heart center. Namaste. Thank you so much for participating in our fitness programs today, but please remember before you start any exercise program to consult with your physician first. Please honor your body. Thank you.